Greetings YouTube as my screen flips around. Welcome back to the channel. We have an important video today to record either way. Either the Jessica Jones hype will be in the contest in both featured crystals and what we're calling banquet crystals this year or not. Alliance Quest Compensate. Oh, I thought I already got this. Huh. Oh. Due to issues with choice nodes, the previous series of Alliance Quest was canceled before it was completed. We we're granting off summoner 60 Alliance tickets to use. Okay. So there's that. Um, all right. So that means. First off, we've got the bonus Alliance Quest compensation. That's that's topic number one of this video. But that also means that Jessica Jones, uh, we assume, because this is always the Tuesday of the month, if there's going to be technically two uh, early access bundles, that the early access bundle drops. And it has not dropped. I think that's partially why Kabam had these uh, six-star shard bundles be two days. So that technically they had an offer on the books for two days. And also why the uh, piggy bank is, what, a, a week long? Either way, here's, here's the reason why this matters. In the economy of the game, Kabam had previously, for the last year at least, given us the biggest trophy champ prize, a truly amazing non-trophy in a trophy champ. Because when you say trophy champ, usually it's just somebody you can brag that you have in your collection. Like Immortal Iron Fist is a good example of trophy champ. It's not that he's the worst champion in the game, but who's going to use him every day, right? You're probably just going to say, hey, I got a six-star Immortal Iron Fist. Or if I'm, uh, if you're as blessed as I was somehow this year, two six-star Immortal Iron Fist. But you're not going to use him. Weapon X, Battlegrounds defensive MVP, I've used him a couple times on offense, and he's won matches. So, for the Battlegrounds, especially now in the game, Weapon X is amazing. The problem is, he used to be the crazy, all too impossible to get rare champion in Greater Gifting Crystals and also in those top rank rewards. And Kabam did this shocking thing during Cyber Week where they gave every whale, and I was a whale for a week, uh, every whale who bought all the offers and was at a certain progression level, the guaranteed chance to get him. And, of course, if you bought all the offers, you had more than enough units to get at least one six-star generic Awakening Gem, assuming you didn't get a Mutant Awakening Gem from the Awakening Gem Crystal if you're Paragon and the Odin deals. So, you don't need him, essentially. You, it might be nice to add some SIGs onto him, or maybe you get seven-star shards or a max SIG ability crystal from him if you took him a SIG 200 like some of you did. But the supply was so shockingly high for players for Weapon X with the right conditions that the demand for him has plummeted in the banquet crystals. So that's why they put Jessica Jones in those crystals. There has to be a new champion to hunt. But besides that, if you have a early access bundle with her, you lessen the demand for Jessica Jones because we can get her guarantees of five star in the early access bundles and have a very rare chance to get her as a six star. And if you get her as a six star, you're maybe just not as excited to go after crystals. So it makes sense why Kabam did not give us a second early access bundle. Now, if they somehow give it to us tomorrow, this entire video will be aged terribly. But my guess is we are going to have the usual one featured champ per December going all the way back to what, Spider-Ham? And that that's going to be it. And then we're going to replace the second champion with the thirst for the 300 units you would normally spend in a Jessica Jones featured cap crystal for a banquet crystal in this case. So, bonus Alliance Quest compensation is appreciated. Uh, I was really hopeful that somehow this was uh, what the banner showed, like more glory so that I could get more Tier 3 Alpha Catalyst or Tier 6 Basic, as always, uh, in the glory store. You know, I do my best to purchase four of each of the levels. And so you can see I've already done that with my Tier 6 Basic, and I've done that with my tier three alpha that's all i purchased right now in the glory store um some of you have told me though that this thing is what you're most excited to purchase because you get to do one day of alliance quest in like less than an hour when you add in both and throw in a couple of units pretty impressive either way um yay for bonus alliance quest 
compensation and Jessica Jones crystals will be not in the game, but she will be a, a probably incredibly rare drop rate in the banquet crystal starting on December 20th, which is one week from today.